the um, TBOC Camps program um, is a really important part of our uh, delivery here in Banbridge. We work initially to um, address that, um, looking at the cultures of Catholics and Protestants um, within Northern Ireland. Um, but then we also go a bit further then looking at all the different nationalities then that call Northern Ireland home. And it's really important for young people to really see how each other think and actually people from like, different backgrounds. It's a good place to go to meet new people. We like got together and we like discussed like the differences and the similarities and we just like done like a whole thing of getting to know each other. If you don't know different people from different like backgrounds, you could grow up to be like, extremely rude towards people or even racist towards people for no reason. So it's been a real struggle trying to kind of think of more innovative ways that we could get young people online. Trying to plan virtual fun events that our kids will get involved in, but also try and facilitate um, a space where we'll be able to discuss all those things that we feel are so important. Um, we have organised virtual like baking tutorials, pottery making that hopefully the kids can share together. Um, we have quiz nights planned. Um, so yeah, it's it's been it's been really difficult. Um, our dates have changed a lot just due to restrictions and our plans have changed a lot. But it still has proven to like work and we've really tried our best with it. They were spot on with like keeping in, in, like on top of the, the restrictions. It was very like safe. We went in and sanitised our hands and everything and everything was socially distanced. So it was very reassuring when we were in. Me personally, this is my uh, would have been my third year plan for TBOC funding. Um, the process is really simple um, and I've actually noticed over the last three years the process has got even easier um, to apply for it. I've been involved with um, TBOC applications for about five years. I would definitely recommend other groups go for it. Definitely it is worthwhile to give children an opportunity. Um, it's all very well structured and laid out. It's easy to follow. Um, it's also very easy to get in touch with TBOC staff if you have ever any questions or problems. Overall the, the process has been quite smooth. It's really about being creative, it's about thinking outside the box and it's about you know trying to be positive and having a positive attitude. You know do your groundwork making sure that you have your groups on board and getting that buy-in is really important but don't be afraid. It is very important to have TBOC camps because the kids learn about themselves and they learn new experiences. You will learn a lot because I have um, even at the different sessions that we've done already I'm learning so much more than I am, like more than I than I knew. It's just a free space to like talk about your beliefs, and nobody took it for granted. Like we all sat there, we all did our part, we all wanted to learn. Tabak is like a good example of everyone does in the end, like think the same and like get on. Like you can still be friends if you're different. A lot of our young people maybe hear different stories from parents or grandparents. Um, and then they maybe have never experienced that, but then they automatically think, oh, well then I can't like one side or I can't like the other. If that's not like in your comfort zone, just go outside it and go beyond it because it's so worth it, meeting new people and just learning. Like I've learned so many things. The feedback we've got from a lot of the participants in the past is that by actually meeting this, people from different backgrounds, it has sort of stripped away all them maybe negative perceptions that maybe they had of somebody from a different community. So for the young people, it's an opportunity to um, meet new people. Um, it's an opportunity to explore the cultures. I think as youth workers, especially within Northern Ireland, we have a responsibility to be taking young people from different communities together. I think TBOC offers us that opportunity. So I would advise anyone that is having an interest in it to apply for that funding. Just, it does open up a lot of doors. Whenever we have the camp program, it's an opportunity for a young person potentially to have their first time away from their from their parents on their own. The the idea of camp and meeting people from these different schools and different backgrounds really excites them, and it's always a, a major highlight. Friendships that are formed between the young people, like as a leader, it's amazing just to see that. And without TBOC and the funding opportunities that they have given us, we would not have been able to host these camps. And we had a guy who was like Rangers mad, like 12th of July mad. I think he actually arrived to camp in his Rangers top. And we had a guy who arrived in a Celtic top. And by the end of the camp, they'd actually switched tops. 
I'd tell them join it because it's good crack and you get the new, you get to meet new people and you go on trips and all. Even if we don't believe in the same things and just because we come from somewhere else doesn't mean we can't be um, friends and that we can't talk to each other. I'd normally not make friends just outside school but this has definitely spread my friendships. It's been a good experience for me met new people, made some new friends. I've been to many different places, I've learned so many new things and I've made so many friends that I still talk to now and I've just become more involved socially altogether. It was really good just to finally after like being in lockdown for months and months trying to find other stuff to do and um, we got tea back and met new people. It's just, it's just like the gateway to like pace really.